Imagine you had the power to take any shape you wanted. And we mean any shape. From changing the way you look, all the way to changing into a different species. The idea of shape-shifting has fascinated us for centuries, ranging from Greek mythology to the X-Men. Science fiction, right? But what if we could pull it off? How could you get your body to shapeshift? And once you did, would you use your powers for good or evil? This is what if, and here's what would happen if you could shapeshift. Let's be honest, every single one of us has thought about shapeshifting. What if you could look like your favorite celebrity? What would it be like to soar through the skies like a bird? What if you could transform into your deepest desires and greatest fears? Daydreaming aside, how could you reprogram your body into taking on another form entirely? Well, it's going to be a little tricky. If we look at Einstein's famous equation, E equals mc squared, we see that mass and energy are related. So if you want to decrease or increase in mass, you either have to release energy or absorb it. So far so good, right? For example, let's say you want to unleash the beast that rages within you, a puppy. What, you thought you were going to be able to go full werewolf on your first try? Please. So let's say you weigh 60 kilograms and want to transform into an adorable six-month-old golden retriever. Oh, what a good boy. Oh, you're a good boy. A good boy who weighs in at 20 kilograms. Well, you'd need to reduce your body mass by 40 kilograms. And that's no easy feat. If we use Einstein's equation, we see that this mass loss will generate 860 megatons of energy. For perspective, that's approximately 17 times the amount of energy released from the largest nuclear bomb ever detonated, the Tsar Bomba. So let's see if we can do this without killing everyone around you. Let's borrow a trick from another member of the animal kingdom, the lizard. Some lizards are known to drop their tails when trying to escape, so maybe this could be one way to reduce your mass. One limb at a time. Not exactly ideal, right? Did not see that coming! And that's just a one-way trip. As a puppy, you would have to store all that energy somewhere to transform back. Our advice is, pick carefully before you shapeshift. But I'm still a good boy. But let's say you managed to pull it off and mastered the skill. Now the real fun can start. Think of all the possibilities. You could turn into anyone or anything. Well, if you want to take the hero route, you could teach the world your newfound power. You could realistically end the entire planet's self-esteem issues. Body image and low self-confidence would be a thing of the past. People could finally be the person they feel they are inside, and all because of you. You know, after you rub a bank. Let's be real, have you noticed most characters with shape-shifting abilities are the bad guys? You could become the ultimate con artist. You could steal the world's fortunes and never be recognized. You could take the form of a world leader and declare a world war. Or you could literally turn into a monster and terrorize humanity. It's a lot of power with even more responsibility. The good news is we won't have to deal with this predicament for quite some time as the ability to shapeshift hasn't been conquered by science yet. But that doesn't mean we can't be fooled. Deep fakes are getting more and more realistic every day, giving humans the ability to make celebrities do anything they want. Whoa, this is heavy. It won't be long until anyone's face can be plastered onto someone else's body. In the meantime, let's focus on a smaller scale of shape-shifting. You can always change your hair, work out, or get a new outfit. Those aren't superpowers, but they're a start. Hey, you do you. But with all this shape-shifting talk, we can't help but wonder what it would be like 
if we had other superpowers? Like, what if you had super strength? Well, that's a story for another What If. <laughs>